Well, well. Hey, you. Hey, it's you. Yes, Frank. It's me, Jax. I heard they shot you down. That you were dead. Apparently, that was wrong. But if you're here, does that mean you're a separatist now? Will you stay here and support our cause? I'm sure you would be very welcome. What cause? We've broken free from Zaykor, from being slaves to Elix. And we've worked, persuaded people to allow us into the city. And now we're here, we are working to be allowed to stay. Would you be willing to help us? I will give you my support. Good. We have to stick together. People blame us for this war, even though we left Zaykor to escape it. They will doubt us until the day peace begins. I mean, they don't even trust each other. Among all these warring people, all these different agendas, we, you and I, share a similar destiny. It's the only way anyone will survive. It seems like you're tolerated here in the city. That is exactly what we are. Tolerated. We are still a long way from being accepted. Well, I for one don't trust you as far as I can throw you. You aren't alone in that view. This city is a place of freedom, but all the old suspicions remain. The outlaws claim they are being oppressed. The clerics say they are neutral, but they aren't. The berserkers, they don't seem to know what they're doing, apart from avoiding their laws. We, we are trying to discover who we are. I think people see that, that we are all here for a new start. Do you need help? It is good that you offer to help us. The Berserkers are already trying to get us thrown out of the city. We need the protection offered by this place. We won't survive without it. We've persuaded people here that we are worth a chance. But there will always be those who won't see it that way. And the Albs and Zaykor want us dead. If we're to stay, we need someone to get to Caleb and York. They are key to our future. About the threat of you being thrown out of the city. What is the problem with Caleb and Yorg? Yorg is a berserker. He's accused us of spying for the Alps and Zaykor. He claims he saw us handing over information about the shield generators. It's completely illogical. We are the ones with the most to lose if Zaykor captures this city. But the free people are prisoners to emotion. It makes them doubt logic. They have already thrown one of our group out of the city. Now, they are threatening the rest of us with the same fate. We are no friends of the Albs and Zaykor. They would see us dead. We want this to be our home now. We need the free people to understand this. I will help you. Good. That is the response I wanted. It is best if you go straight to your Caleb is already attempting further arguments to ensure our expulsion. But it is Jorg's statement that has put us in danger. That lie underpins Caleb's argument against us. If people believe we are working with the enemy, we will be exiled from the city and left to die. But if Jorg confesses his lie, then Caleb would no longer have the proof he claims. They would have no reason to expel us. What goods have you got? Don't mess me around. <laughs> Why are you torturing yourself over that? Stop being an asshole. Wow. Waste of time, wasn't it? Fucking hell. He'll cost all of us. Why are you torturing yourself over that? It's 
Someone's gotta sort this shit out before we drown in it. Well, well. Are you here to pay me those drugs? What do you want from me? To drive me off? Or maybe even have me killed? You don't scare me. Your people are a plague upon this land. Although, there is something different about you. Do you usually spend time with people like us? I was an Alb myself once. Yes. You stopped taking Elix. That is rare. Which makes me question how you did it. May logic guide you. I saw you. You saw me what? I saw how you came through into the dome. Who are you? Why were you allowed in? I was an Alb once. Fuck. What is this, an invasion? Can't you all just go back to Zaycor? What do you have to keep coming here for? Well, you'll find more of your kind back there in the city. But you can go and do whatever it is you Albs do together. But don't get used to it. None of you will be staying long. But before you go, you better tell me what you want here, Alb. Who are you? Caleb. I lead the Berserkers who've chosen to settle here in Abessa. You are separate from the Berserkers in Udan? We have kept our beliefs, but left behind the laws. We have set our own rules here. Well, none of us are allowed to return to Edan now. Or we just end up being sent to the valley. As to why they came here, while well, the first settlers were sent to Abessa to plant a world heart to expand the forest of Edan out here. But they were cut off from Edan by the Alps, left on their own to survive. And after a while, they decided to keep it that way. The warlords in Goliath weren't happy. But they're stretched too thin for another conflict, so here we are. And since they settled here, others have joined us. Some are escaped exiles. Others just chose to leave Edan. What do you have against the Separatists? We came here for peace, to escape the war. How long will that last if more Alps keep coming here? Zaykor has left us alone recently. You think they will if they know all their escapees are coming here? Edan? Ignadon? Fuck it, even Tavar. At some point, if they learn that Alps are sheltering here, then they might attack us even if Zaykor doesn't. And you can tell me whatever you want about us having the same goals, or the same enemy. But you really expect me to believe you Albs are going to choose us over other Albs? I don't care that people vote to let you in. If it was up to me, we would be better off if you lot were thrown out of the city. You want to have all the Separatists thrown out of the city? Yeah. And you know what? I have already started to make it happen. It's easy to find ways to show you people have broken the rules of our agreement. But hey, I have a way you can avoid the same fate. You could do as a service here. You could prove your humanity. Are you prepared to do that? Do you think you're even able? What do you want from me? I need help with the Alps. We have an eyewitness who claims to have seen the Separatists exchanging information with the Alps. Traitorous bastards. 
Who is this eyewitness? The berserker York saw Fenk meet with an alb in front of the city. Why would they meet if it wasn't to exchange information about the dome? Sadly, Jorg is the only one who's seen Fenk. And now he started saying he isn't sure he really saw Fenk meet an alb from Zaykor. So I have to jog Jorg's memory. Or make sure he stops denying what he said. There has to be a way to do that. You don't think that Jorg could have been wrong in the first place? No, never. You can't trust these Separatists. They'll betray us sooner or later for sure. I'm telling you, this is just the beginning. I don't even want to know. If you're here for the food rations, then I'll tell you what I told the other hundred people. Someone must have been making a joke. I don't have anything to sell or give out. So you can just turn around and leave. What are you talking about? The free rations. The free rations, as if there would ever be free rations. Ah, but you're not here for that, are you? Then I'm sorry. I, I have been the butt of a joke that has left me rather angry, and I thought... Well... I'm sorry. It's just... I'm just so sick of it. The belligerence between the Berserkers and Outlaws. Everything was simpler when I was a cultivator in Goliath. We had laws and everyone obeyed them. Why can't people just all work together? If you feel that way, why don't you go back to Goliath? No, no. Those days are gone. I left willingly to establish a world heart here in Abessa. But when it became clear that the seedling wouldn't grow, Caleb decided that we would remain here. And... And whatever Caleb says is best. But now, no. I can't go back. We went against orders from Goliath. If I go back now, they'll just stick me in a cage. No questions asked. Fink sent me. Did he? Well, I don't have anything to say to those albs. This whole thing between Caleb and Fink is starting to get on my nerves. I shouldn't have said anything, okay? But what's done is done, and that's that. Tell me your version of the story. My version? I'm stuck between the two of them. I told Caleb in confidence that I saw Fink meet an alb outside the city. Could have been a separatist, but I wasn't sure. I didn't see any more than that, but Caleb decided to tell the clerics. He convinced me that the alb Fink met must have been from Zaykor. But I have no real idea who he was, or what faction he's with. About this situation with the Separatists. Do you have any idea what I should do? I feel... this is a mess. I should speak to Caleb before I give you any advice. Do that. The less I have to do with this, the better. I know who you're talking about. You have been told. So annoying. So, so annoying. I can make sure York stops denying his story. You can? Do you think you can make York stick to his original story? It's for the good of the city. So how about you go to York and present yourself as an alb? Encourage him to believe that he saw what he saw. It can never be said again that the Albs might be innocent. No, no. I won't accept that. I've heard that before. Stay healthy, all right? Yeah, I think I'm done here. About the situation with the Separatists. Do you have any idea what I should do? I feel... this is a mess. You should keep silent. It's too risky to guess. 
I wish I was as certain as you. But I don't feel right about this. I'm really not sure who I saw Fink meeting. What if Fink really was speaking to a friend? But the chances of an alb from Zaykor coming so close to the domed city is really low, isn't it? No, I, I don't really believe that it was an alb. I mean, how often do you see them on their own? I am an alb. Trust me. I know when albs are lying. You're an alb? A former alb. Like you, I can't go home without them thinking I'm a traitor. I know albs, and Fank is lying. Well, then you're right. The risk is too great. Thank you for backing me up. I've been so worried about the truth. You've helped me decide. Thank you. The Separatists must leave the city. I will go to Caleb and tell him that I won't say anything. Can I help you? Don't mess me around, or I'll mess with you. Is she really so gullible? The Albs were exiled from the city. Then you convinced York to speak up. You did well. Allowing them in the city was simply too big a risk. You have earned your place among us humans, Alb. You prove that you listen to your soul. I respect that. That should serve you as reward enough. What do you want, Yorg? You sent someone to me because you seem to be afraid that I would admit my fears. I sent someone to you for the security of the city. You know what you saw, you're just afraid of what it could mean. Yes, yes, that's true. I just wanted to say that I'm behind you. I mean, even if... If it wasn't an alb that Feng spoke to, the risk of letting the Separatists stay in the city is simply too great. I'm glad to hear you say that. And I'm glad that you stand behind me. You've always been loyal, Yorg. Don't worry. I will speak with Alois and ensure these Separatists don't threaten what we have here. Thank you, Caleb. I know you're right. Is that so? 